guys welcome back to another video with your girl pretty and this is pretty moments um i hope all of you are doing well i hope all of you are good and uh, to all my rating subscribers welcome back to another video with me if you're seeing this face for the first time please be sure to comment like and share please support we need to grow yeah we really need to grow so guys today i'm coming with a topic that is very interesting and i do have a visitor seated next to me so uh he's going to introduce himself but before he does guys he's opening a, a channel uh for himself he's going to create the channel today as we speak a so reality please, show channel. yeah reality show channel so uh guys i'm going to attach the link to his channel on the description box Please be sure to click the link and subscribe. Do it for me. Do it for the love. Let's support each other. So today, guys, there's a post I saw on Facebook about one of our well-known actors here in South Africa. His name is Silo. Um, yeah. Okay, let me just go to the post so that I can uh, catch up on what is really happening there. Okay, so here the post says that Silo Mark, I'm going to post it somewhere on the side. It says that Silo Mark is contemplating suicide or he contemplated suicide. He wanted to commit suicide because he's going through some issues with his wife and that is they are married in community of property and the wife is now uh, planning to divorce him and sell his property that he's living in because obviously she's getting 50% of what he owns. So we're sitting here to discuss all that, but before we do, kindly introduce yourself. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, I'm spending a pretty moment with um, Pretty Asaf. Uh, my name is Sam and I'm going to be starting my reality show about coast reality show and because of this kind of stuff so that's why i'm starting it because a lot of people have to be educated when it comes to relationship and marriage so exactly. i'm here with you today guys let's discuss oh yeah guys so uh just so that we don't miss any point i wrote some of the questions that i want us to be answering so number one says why do people get married and suddenly just separate or maybe suddenly just divorce like what's the cause of all this i think like right now it looks like a norm to everyone like it's something that is just happening constantly people that we know that they just recently got married all of a sudden they just divorce like so i'm i'm having these questions and if you guys think like maybe you have or you feel like you have an answer to that also give us your view on the comment section but let's hear from sam what he what he thinks about this whole thing why do you think people suddenly just divorce out of their marriage what do you think is the cause of all this divorce that listen, is happening listen listen um my own perspective i, I can talk for another people mm -hmm, yeah you understand but uh what i've been perceiving around and you know i'm not new to relationship also so exactly, yeah. they give me breakfast i give people breakfast so <laughs> but, <laughs> you're saving but, each other but, 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 but what i know is when you enter a relationship with a mission mm -hmm. you have to accomplish your mission and when the mission is finished you need to leave but what do you mean by mission i think it's uh people doesn't practice love these days anymore because they practice that no okay this is the guy that is successful let me just start him okay. this is a lady that is because i don't want to it goes both ways but yeah. it goes both ways there's a lot of guys that know they want they want to involve in a lady because that lady is successful mm. so they have to be collecting collecting the day that the lady doesn't want to give anymore the move it's the same thing as lady mm. when the entire relationship Automatic, according to my own perspective, lady doesn't enter a relationship with a clear mind. You always see something. Uh, I'm, I don't know about okay, you. Okay. But I <laughs> no, said I'm according, I, I, yeah. according to my Your own, own perspective. view, how you're viewing it. Because right? lady can see that, no, this girl is going to be successful if that person never gets rich. But I'm talking about people, that is, the guys that's already there, mm. that have already made money. You understand? Lady entered them. It might not be love but what they can benefit out of that relationship okay so why do you say what you're trying to say is that people go into relationship looking at what they're going to benefit and that's one of the reason why people break up this is our generation we don't go there because of love you get there because of mission i immediately they accomplish that mission they want to move out because I don't see the reason because of that thing is right. It's something like, like seven months my relationship. Mm, so yeah, seven to seven month marriage. Mm. They enter then they want to divorce. Because the lady knows that they've already married the community of properties. 
yeah, whatever you have is 50 50 so to... it's free to get because if you marry today in the community of property tomorrow you are divorcing the point is you are getting 50 50 out of the relationship so i think people just enter a relationship with mission yeah not I... with love Okay, that thing, that guys, vision. what's your own take? What do you think? What do you think is the cause of all divorce that is yeah. happening around? So, with all that being said, let's go to number two. Is it okay to marry in community of property? So, what do you think? Do you think it's okay to marry in community of property? <laughs> we don't do this. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? What do you think? What do you think? My is it brother. okay or is not okay? My, what is my mine brother? is mine. What is yours is yours. <laughs> don't come. But listen guys okay listen, wait guys. sorry while we're still there is yeah. it okay to marry in community property and on top of that i want to ask you if you've been there <laughs> <laughs> so you are... <laughs> yeah answer listen listen um to be realistic uh joke apart right now there's two things that i, I always tell people which is my channel is going to be on yeah. right you have to discover yourself in a lot of stuff you don't just go into the marriage We've done it, we fall out of it. We slide into the DM, we slide out. So, but the point now is this. For me, marrying in community of property, there's nothing wrong with it. You both of you have a clean agenda in terms of that relationship. But then how do you tell if one has a clean agenda? That is why discovery. You have to discover yourself. And that is what my channel is going to be all about. You know, split it. Because it's not, it's not a day topic. It's going to be serious for like two months a month we go all in on on it how you can get because i'll fail in a lot of my relationship i went there with the clean mind i ran out when i see their dirty mind you understand so the point is this you will never identify who is the fake you can perceive it a little bit but my point that i'm you trying to analyze don't, 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 don't let me get out of this topic mm. what i can say is Marrying community of poverty is going to be the not poverty, property is going to be the best mm. because how will you feel if we are building a relationship together? Then we get to home affair, or we get a church, and or we uh, the, the civil marriage, and they ask you in front of me, and we are showing love, we're sleeping in the same place, and they're going to ask questions that no, listen, are you guys want to marry the community of property? And I say no. If that lady have a mission, that's the first day that I'm digging my own grave, according to my own. So the point is this, if I'm not ready for relationship, mm -hmm. I'd rather not go there. We don't go near marriage. Let's just be doing our own thing. Mm -hmm. Then when I know that I'm sure, because a lot of things happen along the line. You can't be having kids with somebody and you say you don't marry in the community of properties. What if you passed away? It doesn't really matter that maybe the lady kill you right now or or maybe anything happened but the point is this what of if anything happened along the way then you're gonna leave that lady stuck so that is just my own makes sense guys please so be commenting also be telling us your mind so another one it says what are the advantages and disadvantages of marrying into community of property what do you think are the disadvantages and advantages of marriage. This disadvantage is what we are seeing now. Seven months. Pa. They don't enter. They don't enter. <laughs> Omar, they don't pay. So <laughs> everything Mother that I draw. Everything everything that I want. <laughs> 50 50 <laughs> percentage. It's gonna be like <laughs> so my point is this now. Guys, it's very advantageous to marry in the community of property. Just to save yourself from trouble. Mm. Because the point is this. There's also family at the other side. Yeah. Kids involved. We have kids involved. We have a lot of people that passed away at the end of the day. The family take over the, the, the property of the of the guy. Mm -hmm. And the lady doesn't know anything. Then they have to be start suffering. The kids have to start suffering. So if people marry the community of property, when you die, at least you know you, you take the legacy for your husband. If you are not the one that initiated the, the passed away. So Marry out of the community of property with the family that I've already saw. It's not fun. Literally, the, the, the work that the lady is the one that murdered the guy, then they have to take this, you know. Family always have their own agenda aside. But at the same time, when you marry in the community of property, and the lady Yeah, but then you, also, so, I, 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 it, it, it's a lot of stuff that involves in this thing. So, yeah, I also see that the cause of 
or especially here in SA, I'm not going to talk about other countries because I don't know, but I feel like most people that are being killed lately is because of all this. It's either the whole issue of insurance and whatever, they've registered you somewhere, put your name somewhere, <laughs> then money, uh, insurance is going to pay in case you die or more. They will give you slow poison, you chop up nothing. <laughs> well, we registered you go, <laughs> <laughs> Ah, why not? to have it, it then it's, really when really I die it becomes your benefit that you are getting like two yeah, million then the in the house now there's no money you we are see, broke the problem now is that <laughs> now they use death to be killing people which is very wrong how can my life be useless for you but my death is when very benefit <laughs> in <laughs> no, South no. Africa well, that's how it's happening no, so, no, 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 no. I feel like okay for me the advantage and the disadvantage, whatever. But the whole, the most important thing is that we should just look more into this killing. This thing is cause is the one that come with this killing. Number four says, will you or will you not? What are your reasons? Will you marry in community property or will you not? And what are your own reasons? Support your answer. The point is, if I if I'm getting married two hundred times. I will be getting married when they are full of shit. I get out. I will be getting. It's, and it's okay to get out. It's, it's okay to move. Mm. But the okay. point is this: I can never get married out of community or property. Why? Only if I'm if I'm not having kids with that person. Okay. The moment that I have first kid, second kid, I'm gonna marry in the community or property because most of the thing that I labor for is not for me. Yeah. It's for my kids. It's not even for her. Because at the end of the day, both of us is going to go. Yeah. Then if I marry out of community or property, the point is the family is there. What of if they, if they do what I didn't send them? Mm. Yeah. You understand? What of if they do what I didn't yeah, send them? They have to chase the wife out. They have to yeah. chase the kids out. Uh, you know, all this story that I'm not even sure. Maybe the kids, it doesn't even look like my brother. So all those things is very, it's very stressful. So, the point is just study the person you want to get married to. At least 80% make sure of a mission in your life. Mm -hmm. So when you are not sure of it, don't go to it. But when you are sure, go ahead. When both of you have a clean mind, go for it. I will marry in the community or property in any day, any time. Okay. I can't. I don't know about other people, but the point is this. Now for me, but I think like everybody is a suspect right now when it comes to all this marrying and community property. Your husband will be looking at you with one eye. Even no, the husband the, the, is no a listen, don't make a mistake. The moment you, your mind is kicking for your partner, don't do it. Mm -hmm. Don't, for your own sake, don't even go to altar, talk less of getting married. Before you uh, ask that question, don't even go there. Because asking that question and you are, uh, you are replying to the person that no. I'm not going to marry in the community or property. Can raise another fight in the family. Mm -hmm. That what do you take me for? You know, all those questions you don't want to answer. So the point is, the moment you are, you are not sure about what you are doing in a relationship or what your partner is doing in a relationship, then don't go to marriage. Don't go to marriage. Just be producing. It's fine. But the moment you know that, okay, listen, this one is ready to support me in everything that I do. It doesn't want my downfall, it's there to console me, it's there to do this. Then you can go ahead. And there's no problem about that. I don't think there's a problem. That is for me. I don't know for the other people. Okay, guys, let us know. Will you marry? Are you married in community of properties? What are your fears? What are you seeing that is a red flag somehow that you feel like on my bill? I said they will kill me for this marriage oh, because of this small car where they drive. <laughs> So guys, please let us know what to take on this marrying in community of property. Personally, I don't think it's a wrong thing to do. But lately we have people that with their minds are so evil. They look at, maybe they stay with you a year or two. Once you succeed, they're already planning on how to end your life. Agenda, that's the agenda yeah. relationship. They mm. have an agenda in that relationship. It's not true. Yeah, that exactly. Because they want to take over what belongs to you, which I feel like is totally wrong. So guys, I'm, um, I'm coming up with a series which we call, I'm going to title it Love Series. This is one of the videos that is opening for uh, the series that is coming. So please be sure to stay tuned. I'm not going to delay with videos. I know that I've not been consistent, but from now on, we are going to be consistent. Please, like I said, he's opening a channel. Guys, do go and support. He's bringing a lot of knowledge, guys, a lot of wisdom, a lot of things that you're going to learn about love. They don't save and breakfast finished. So... <laughs> yes, they don't stop you. 
Then I saw he's got the experience to say a lot. Let me finish. He has a lot to share. Honestly, like on a very serious note, he has a lot to share. Look out for that. Um, college reality show, right? College reality show. Yeah. Oh yeah, no, college reality, reality show. show. So it's going to be there. We um, we going to you're going to see um. Different videos on different topics. We're going to be breaking down. Sometimes you will feature me. I'll also leave my views and takes on the videos and all that. So please be sure to subscribe. We love you guys. And what do you have to say to say goodbye to them? The most, um, let me say the, the most important thing why I'm creating this channel is because I can see a lot of guys dying in a relationship. You understand what He's I mean? He's standing up for men, guys. I, I, I'm He's standing, standing up there for, for both men. genders. Okay. Because, like mostly men. But mostly men because uh, the way men are passing away this side. Like most people that die this year, they are just fall and die. So I don't understand it's like a um, monthly of fire prayer. Mm. Fall and die, fall and die. So we <laughs> <don't>... <laughs> So yeah. I don't really understand exactly what is going on, but what I notice is because we've been getting married to the wrong person. And from the beginning of our relationship, we see that red flag, but we omit it. Mm. We just we look away like no, it's gonna change. Overlook it's gonna... The we flags, overlook. Yeah. And that is exactly what will kill us or what will bring the separation at the end of the day so i'm bringing a lot of stuff subscribe just watch out you can post your relationship if you don't mind anyway. mm -hmm. after you mm -hmm. listen to it you decide maybe you're gonna get married or not yeah i have a lot of failure more than what you can think of so that is why i'm bringing the experience, the experience for the future is generation because we are, destroying, also, the yeah, we are destroying a lot of future generation right now mm, it's actually good to share from experience do not just mm. come on youtube and share view on what you don't know Yo, so yeah, it's, it's proper that. to share views on what you know so with all that being said guys i love you so much please comment like and share please most importantly comment on the section on the comment section let us know what you think what you feel about this whole thing that we just discussed here mm. are you if you're not married i do you think it's wise for you to go ahead and get married in community or property and if you are married what do you think um will happen at the end do you think that <laughs> this thing is gonna favor you or favor the next person Rano. but the only thing is <laughs> <Rano. laughs> the only thing is no one can predict tomorrow nobody knows that you, uh, you god forbid you can be the wife that died first you can be the husband that died first and whoever right. takes over mm -hmm. but also we do not pray for divorce divorce we don't encourage it but it's also good to walk away it's also very proper to walk away when things so are not walk up like move <laughs> <laughs> Bye guys, I'll see you guys in my next video. I love you so much. Bye. Thank you. I'll see you on my channel. Bye.